Hello dear Goinkans, hope you all are doing fine. Today we are going to learn converting text to a table and inserting pictures in a table. Let's begin. If we talk about converting text into a table, so we can always convert existing text to a table. For that what we need to do is, first we need to enter the data. Let's write some data. Say for example, I'll write serial number. Once you have written the data, make sure you separate the data with either commas or tabs. So each time you're writing a word, then you have to leave a comma or a tab. So let's give it a tab and then I'll write items, then I'll write price. I'll move to the next line. I'll write first tab, the item. And then a tab item price item price so this is all uh, the text that we want to convert into a table what we need to do is we need to select the text once uh, we have selected the text, we'll click on the insert tab, click on the table button, select the convert text to table option. The dialog box will appear. Now we'll define the number of columns and rows respectively. So number of columns, yeah, we need only three columns. So let it be three there. Okay. Then we have separate text add. If you have used tab, so you will select the tab. If you have used comma, so we'll select the commas. So I have used tab, so I'll be selecting tabs only. Then OK. Our text has automatically been converted into table. This is how we convert text into table. The next thing that we're going to learn is how we can insert a picture in a table. Let's insert a column to the right side. Let's write the name heading as pictures. Now let's insert the picture of the ice cream. I've already downloaded a picture, so let me insert that. To insert a picture in a table, we'll click on the cell where we want to insert the picture. Then we'll go into the insert, we click on the picture, we select the location of the picture. So my picture is at desktop. I'll select the picture, click on insert, the picture will be inserted then we what we need to do is we need to just resize the picture using these small squares that are available around the picture so let me reduce it more this is how we can insert a picture you can insert multiple pictures in multiple cells this was for today thank you and take care